Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the post event press conference for the CBMM Myobium Punta SA EPRI for the 2017-2018 ABB Formula E Championship. And we have our winner. He's joined us, John Eric Firth at Tachita. Congratulations, Jeff. Thank you. Great result for you today. A great race. Second place for Audi Sport, Ab Schaefer, Lucas Degrassi, and in third position, Sam Bird for DS Virgin Racing. Gentlemen, well done. Um, Sean Eric, let's start with you. It was a, a hard fought, fought victory, which has given you a 30 point advantage in the, the championship standings now. A near perfect day for you, so you must be highly satisfied with your day's work today. I'm, yeah, I'm obviously very happy. Uh, championship, I personally don't want to hear 30 points, 25 or 1 point. I saw last year, I said when we had a extra advantage and they still lost the championship so um, I'm not focusing on that at all I want to focus on every race and uh, yeah obviously winning the race today in this condition with uh, to me one of the best uh, driver I race uh, against with Lucas and uh, obviously is the, 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 the title holder uh, was uh, really tough uh, I think I can handle the pressure pretty, pretty well and today I even proved it to myself that I could um, I didn't know if I could do it, uh, but I, you know, but I did. I haven't done uh, one mistake uh, in the whole race, and uh, yeah, I'm really pleased with that result. You came under extraordinary pressure from uh, Lucas throughout the race, really, from lap one. Do you consider it your hardest fourth victory of the three that you've had in Formula E so far? I don't remember the other ones, but uh, <laughs> right now, yes, this probably was the, 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 the hardest one. Uh, I don't think I won that many races either, but uh, it was probably the one that I'm the most happy with uh, in terms of my driving and uh, my whole race, uh, what I've done with it. Um, yeah. Well done, Sean Congratulations and to you. You know, one thing I want to do is that I'm... Uh, what I'm the, the most pleased about is the work we're doing in, the, in my team. Uh, we don't have easy days uh, right now. I'm pushing them so hard that uh, you know sometimes people may not be happy. Uh, but today, winning the race uh, is a proof to everybody that hard work pays. And uh, yeah, I've had some fights in the team basically, and you know just to let it open because I push people sometimes too hard. But we are the only private team, and in order for us to beat those guys, Audi, uh, DS, Ono. Uh, we have to work twice harder as them. We don't have any testing. We have a lot of less tools to play with uh, to improve the car and uh, uh, on the power chain. So um, it makes me happier because for the rest of the season, I know that now everybody will push as hard as me in the team. Indeed, well done to you, Sean Eric, and, okay. and to the Tachita team. Second place, Lucas Degrassi. Lucas, you tried mightily. It looked like you didn't leave anything. Uh, out there in terms of trying to get your first win of the season. I suppose on one hand it's a relief to get some big points, but on the other some disappointment, especially after what happened in qualifying today. Uh, first of all, congratulations to uh, Generic and to Sam. Uh, Generic for winning and Sam from coming from 10th uh, place in the grid. So it was uh, a really tough race for me, uh, but to be honest, I think the Jack didn't do any mistake. I tried very hard. We had the, the faster car today, uh, and uh, what what it was for me the, the the downside of the day was the disqualification in the qualifying, uh, which was uh, uh, for me not uh, not correct, um, and uh, that allowed uh, uh, well starting from second uh, in the dirty side. And I tried. In the end, really, really hard to overtake. Jeb, he defended very well. Um, very satisfied with the car that I had. Um, but uh, today we could have done uh, 28 points and we did only 18. Uh, it's not always that you have that. We know that in Formula E. And sometimes when you have the chance, you have to grab everything you, you, you can have. Like I said, the racing was typically close and intense for Formula E. Did you enjoy the battle with Jean Eric and trying to get a, a way through? Yeah, especially in the closing stages when there was a few contacts, shall we say. Yeah, yeah uh, I mean, uh, uh, this track is really, really difficult to overtake, especially if the guy in front wants just to defend. Uh, uh, in his case, there was, I mean, uh, it's not like you're in the back, you just need to defend, and Jeff defended very well, so there was very little margin for me to attack. 
I used one time that he did a small mistake coming into the last sector to, to try something, we end up touching a little bit, uh, was super close. But in a track like this, uh, which he came and with the braking that uh, breakings that moves around, not a straight line break, is super difficult to overtake. Uh, so I tried my best, really. I have to thank uh, Audi Sport. Uh, the car is super competitive. That will not be the last time this year that we're going to fight for victories. So I'm looking forward for this second part of the championship uh, uh, that uh, that we're gonna we're gonna move up. Well done, Lucas, on a fine drive today. Moving over to Sam Bird in third place for DS Virgin Racing. Uh, Sam, ninth to third, a fine drive from you today. I mean, you, you sort of did well with your energy levels in the first portion of the race, which gave you a, a nice platform to deliver in the second phase. Is that how the race panned out for you today? Yeah. Um, we were a little bit fortunate with Boemi having an issue um, or getting damaged. Uh, I don't know what happened with Daniel in the second stint, uh, but that was again another position gifted to me. Um, but the pace was the pace was okay today, to be fair. Um, I just really wanted these two to fight a little bit more, um, but I kind of ran out of laps. But um, no, very strong race. Nice to get another podium. Uh, we needed it from where we started, and uh, kind of damage limitation a little bit for the championship. Jeb's streaking away because he's doing an amazing job, and it's uh, great to see the man Lucas back on it. Um, one thing I would like to say is that last week, uh, Britain lost um, an amazing journalist, um, a great man who brought so much energy to, especially I think called the um, Autosport show. Um, so, I, it's not a win, it's the best I could do, and I'd like to dedicate this to Henry Hope Frost. Uh, there was a lot of fever out there today, and I think he'd be very happy and, and very proud of the driving that happened today. Fine words, Sam, and uh, someone who knew Henry, I think everybody uh, uh, shares your thoughts. Thank you for that. And uh, just, just fun in the, the last few uh, laps of the race, you got onto the tail of, of Sean Eric and Lucas, and it looked like there could be a three way battle, and then Drop back a bit. Was was that purely temperature? And, uh, yeah, and I lost I lost regen really early with our with our um, systems. We we tend to lose regen a little bit earlier than some other people. Uh, that was definitely the case today in uh, hot temperatures. Um, I tried my best to hang on to the back of them, hoping that they would uh, battle it out a little bit more. Um, but then on the last lap, I just snuck the uh, just locked the the front left brake into the double left hander at the very far side of the track. And then I called it a day. Uh, just thought, well, third is, third is fine. Well done on that third position to you and the team. We're now going to open the floor to.